Right guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to talk a little bit about what I'm going to be up to during October, okay? So, um, I've been trying to put together a video about my pile of shame uh, and trying to work on models and get them finished and upon realising that about 20% of the unpainted models um, that we actually have in our collection are orcs um, I figured what better time to crack on and get a load of these models painted up um, and of course work towards showing you the pile of shame video uh, and progressing to reducing that pile of shame by killing two birds with one stone or rather two umis with one chopper um, by painting a lot of orcs during October. So I'm going to show you some of the models I'm going to be working on. Some of them are from Gear Goods Mech Shop, which I have 3D printed. If you saw my 3D printing video previously, um, I've been printing some of them, some some of his stuff. It, it, it's phenomenal. It really is. Uh, go and sign up to his Patreon. It's about eight pounds a month, and you get like 20, 25 files per month, and they're an awesome sculpts. Awesome. So I'm going to be painting up a lot of those guys. Now the aim for this is to paint as many points of orcs as possible but also paint as many models as possible so finding that balance is going to be uh, a little bit difficult but i'm going to show you some of the models and uh, make sure that you are following us over on twitch we live stream doing hobby streams about twice sometimes three times a week uh, so come and hang out with us on twitch uh, i'll try and stream some of it on youtube um, but basically at the end of the month we're going to come back and see how many of around about 200 orc models we actually get painted and how many points we get painted as well dun, dun, dun. <laughs> so this is probably the like the the biggest point heavy stuff that we've got uh to paint for the orc so this is some of the stuff that i'm going to start working on uh th we've actually got like six killer cans i think uh death copters we've got bikes i've 20 30 looters maybe um big metal shock attack gun and a boss we've got a, a what the forge world boss on bike three custom built mech guns we've got these squig killer cans that are 3d printed uh i've actually got these squig riders i can't remember the official names of them uh shock jump dragster i've got a custom booster blaster somewhere as well uh, this is my custom built kill rig. So this is a flak truck from uh, Gear Guts with a oh, 40k container. These parts are actually off the odd sled, which again is on Gear Guts. Uh, and the, the Werboy on top is from that as well. Uh, and then I've just built this up with like loads of little bits. Uh, we've got a battle wagon and we've got a... This was a pirate Nauta. It's actually a Gorkonaut. Um, and as you can see, it's pirate themed. So he's got like a peg leg. He's got a hook instead of his claw. He's got like a blunderbuss. Um, and I haven't glued his face on. But if you actually look at the hull, like you can see it's like a ship with like shark teeth where it's been split open. And then of course you've got the grot on the mast on top. So like, that's like 360, 70 points or something. And then obviously the kill rig is going to be quite a few. My brushes of choice throughout this project are going to be this set of synthetic brushes from Artiscapade. And if you are interested in getting a full set of 15 brushes, you can get 15% off with the link below. I've really enjoyed painting with these brushes and there is a whole range of brushes available in this set. Here we have the round brush that helps you get into all of those crevices around the curvature of the shield on this Mortec guard. And of course the round comes in several sizes. Next up we've got the spot brushes. There's three sizes of these in the set and these are absolutely perfect for getting eyes painted very neatly. Next up is the flat set. There's about three flat brushes and this is perfect for very big blocky colours, so perfect for painting your base rims as well as painting panels on vehicles.
and we also have the liner brushes as well which is perfect for getting any fiddly block colors done this set comes in one package guys you can get 15 percent off by clicking the link below uh, the handles are fantastic i find them very comfortable to paint with so go and please check them out for 15% off. But for now, let's get back to the video. So, these are some of the stuff that I'm going to jump into head first and start and get some of these painted. Probably this guy because he's half done. Um, and the kill rig and the battle wagon, I think. So, make sure that you're following us on Twitch, guys. Make sure you follow on Instagram. I'll be posting pictures of stuff that I paint as I go. And... Um, yeah, if there's anything of any interest that you would like to see, perhaps a tutorial on or a painting video on, um, or even a 3D printing or conversion video or something, um, let me know and uh, I'll see what I can do for you. So here we go, I've got a load of stuff primed, but the first thing I'm working on is my converted kill rig. So make sure that you're following us on Twitch and YouTube, guys. Make sure you press the subscribe or follow button and... Uh, Come and hang out and see us paint stuff like this.